What is up YouTube? Happy spring to all my viewers out there. And uh, you know what spring means. That means baseball right around the corner. I believe we are, tomorrow is a week away from baseball. So that is very, very exciting. So I'm excited to rip some baseball because it is that time of year. So this is Topps Heritage 2021 baseball. The box is just, it struck my eye. Um, I love the design this year for 1972. Uh, heritage and we're also looking for autographs and relics i've seen a decent amount of relics come out of these uh boxes i remember last year the big chase card was the jordan alvarez and um aristides aquino um a rookie card they they had them on a dual card so um i believe they're doing those dual rookie cards as well this year oh i didn't get enough of that box sorry guys i believe they're doing that again, though, as I said. Um, so we'll we'll find out when we get into this. Uh, and I know the short prints are from 400 to 500 this year. And we do have two boxes to get into. So I'm not going to talk for long because um, we got a lot of packs to open. And I don't want to keep you guys here for, you know, too long. <laughs> but... Topps Heritage 2021. Here's the pack. As I said, that is just an awesome, awesome looking uh, artwork there by Topps. I'm really, really impressed and uh, looks super, super nice. So here we go with Cody Bellinger. Pulled his auto out of Top Series 1. Uh, 2020 World Series Game 1. That's pretty nice of Mookie Betts. He had a great World Series. Charlie Blackman. Uh, and here's an insert, Boyhood Photos of the Stars. I like this, Matt Olson with the um, him as a, a young kid playing, Brad Keller, James McCann. And we have our first rookie, Christian Pache, in action. That is a nice one. Wow, so that is a nice, nice card right there. We'll put that to the side. That's a nice first pack there. Definitely high on Pache. Let me know down in the comments which rookie you guys are... Uh, most impressed with or uh, here's a Devin Williams top uh, gold cup card um, Danny Jansen yeah let me know down in the comments who you guys are most in, uh, impressed with this uh, thus far in the spring and who do you expect to be rookie of the year or have the best year as a rookie and here's one of those uh, triple cards here with uh, 2021 rookie stars NL and AL you have Ian Anderson who had a great uh, postseason with the Braves and Debbie Garcia and Christian Javier. That's a nice, nice card. As I said, uh, it looks like they're doing those, you know, um, rookie cards with a um, mix of players. And there's a nice Bo Bichette in action, second year. I like that card. Moving right on through here, I'm going to move a little bit quicker because we do have a bunch of. We do have 144 cards to get through, and this is just not wanting to come. So, Rio Ruiz. I really love the design, though, this year. It is awesome. And here's a Chris uh, Bubik rookie card, Boyhood of the Stars. That's pretty nice. There we go. And 2020 pitching leaders of Max Free Fried. Uh, Zach Davies and Yu Darvish. I like that card. That's a pretty nice insert. So Topps Heritage seems like it is the second of the baseball. We haven't seen much since Series 1 came out. We've seen a little bit of Donruss, but I haven't seen it uh, in retail. So um, this is the second product that I'm ripping of the year because I didn't get a Donruss uh, hobby box. Uh, Frankie Montas, Pete Alonzo, and Brandon War uh, Brandon Workman. Roberto Clemente, the great one. Interesting. I like that insert. Um, so, yeah. And then I think I believe the next product to come out is Gypsy Queen, which I am super, super hyped about. Really love Gypsy Queen. Uh, loved it last year. And I think we 
ordered a hobby box of that, so that video is going to be coming. Nice Ronald Acuna Jr. right there. Matt Chapman in action. Pablo Lopez. And in action, Max Kepler. All right, so the box is starting to die down a little bit here. Let's see, you know, Alec Bohm here. Um, really high on Alec Bohm this year. I think he has a good chance of winning um, Rookie of the Year for the AL. Sandy. But yeah, that uh, Gypsy Queen Hobby Box video will be posted during the week of Easter. So that should be a very fun rip and very fun video. And we have a Tim Anderson in action. So we haven't seen a rookie in a while here. We got two packs left of this first blaster box. And then we'll move right into the next one. Come on, let's pull something good here. Here we go with Luke Voigt. No mummers are. Yeah, but let me know down in the comments what you guys think about this design this year. Let me know if you guys are going to pick anything up. 2020 AL RBI leaders. I like these cards a lot. You got Mike Trout there, Luke Voigt, Abreu, and Jose Ramirez. It's a bunch of big names right there on one card. And a nice Spencer Howard rookie right there. That is nice. Um, I think Spencer Howard is going to be a good pitcher. And... Um, and that's D. Strange Gordon. That's interesting. 486. Oh, that's... Uh, I think this is a short print right here. Uh, definitely a short print, I believe. D. Gordon. So we did get a short print. That is pretty nice. Let me know down in the comments if uh, that is a short print. Uh, just to double check. Joey Bart. I'll double check after this video as well. And we got a nice... Uh, so we heated up there. We got a little Joey Bart action. Spencer Howard. And a short print. So that is pretty nice. Uh, with that pack. Easily probably the best pack of the box. Uh, let me see here. So we got Sonny Gray, Nick Solak, uh, 2020 NL batting leaders. Those are nice cards. Put that over to the side. Adam Engel. Flashbacks, 1972. Bo Bichette, another Bo there. Mike Trout in action. Always nice to get a nice Mike Trout. That is nice. So we're going to go straight into our next blaster box here. And probably move through it a little bit quicker. Don't want to keep you guys here all day, like I said. But definitely wanted to show you guys the um, new product here. There we go with our packs. There we go. So let's get into this. Now, this was supposed to actually come out on Friday. But it was on my Target shelves a little bit earlier. So if you guys want to go check out your Target shelves, it should be there. Because the flippers aren't going to be going after it that much. I'm not too sure about your Targets, though, if they have limits or not yet. If they have limits, and we have a nice Andre Jimenez here while I'm talking. But if they have limits, it should be definitely on the shelf. Because, you know, um, they're just there for the end. What do we have here? We have a Topps Heritage Chrome card. Wow, these are nice. This is the first time I've seen this. Um, 440. Oh, it's out of 999. Nice. So it's numbered. Wow, a numbered uh, short print, I believe, here of uh, Brandon Nimmo. So that is a nice Topps uh, uh, Heritage Chrome card out of 999. That would have been sweet to get of a rookie. Uh, Dodgers World Series. And nice, a Casey Mize. You guys know I'm PC and Casey Mize. That is definitely getting sleeved up after this video and top loaded. Um, Casey Mize is my guy. Uh, big Tigers fan. Can't wait for opening day. Although we are going to be horrible. So um, I'll be excited for the first two games. But after that, uh, you know, it's going to be pretty tough to watch. We have White Sox rookie and stars. Porcello, and we have a AL postseason of Randy or Rosarina. I like this card. This card's sick. He had an amazing postseason with the Rays. Anthony Rizzo, and another Anthony Rizzo, actually. So, moving right along here, um, I think I had a... I didn't finish on a thought that I said. I'm talking nonstop. Sorry, guys, but... Um, yes, 
what I think I was talking about the flippers and uh, about this product. Definitely should be able to find it if it has, if you if your target has limits. My target has limits of three per customer. And we have NL League Leaders Home Run Leaders. That's pretty. That's a nice card. I like that. Brett Anderson, Eric Thames, Renato Nunez, and a nice Kyle Lewis Gold Cup card. I like those. I like the Gold Cup cards. They're pretty slick. So we got um, five packs left. Um, and we're going to get right into it. But yeah, if you haven't liked the video thus far, uh, I would really appreciate if you guys could leave a like if you've made it this far. Uh, that would be much appreciated. Uh, really helped out the channel a lot. And I love to hear your guys' feedback down in the comments. So that would be amazing. And if you haven't hit the subscribe button, I promise you, you won't regret hitting that button. Uh, we are on the road to 300 subscribers, and it would mean the world to me if you guys drop a sub. If you're new, uh, we're going to be doing a 300 subscriber giveaway, so stay tuned for that. Make sure you are staying tuned. Uh, here we go. And John Lester, Wilson Contreras, Max Muncy, and another Boba Shit in action card. Jeez, how many Boba Shets have we pulled second year? <laughs> Feels like a bunch. Uh, I, I, I'm a big Boba Shet fan, so I don't mind getting any Boba Shets. I think he's going to be a great player for a long, long time. The question is if he's going to be better than Fernando Tatis. Uh, here we go with William Contreras and Tyler Stevenson uh, rookie stars. So that's the rookie dual card that I was talking about earlier. JBJ, Jacob Junis, Daniel Hudson, Aaron Judge in action. And another Pache. Nice. So we got another Pache that we're doubling up on the Pache's. I'm really high on this guy. Uh, I know a bunch of Braves fans that uh, definitely love Pache over there. And um, probably going to draft him on my fantasy team, actually. So... Hopefully, none of my people in my fantasy league are uh, listening to this because I don't want to give anything out. Nice, Luis Robert Gold Cup. Let's go. That is an amazing card. These cards are really, really sick with that green border. Um, that card is just really, really nice. Martin Perez, Jorge Alfaro, Brady Singer, rookie card. I don't think he had a rookie card in Top Series 1, but they gave him one in Heritage, so... Uh, Brady Singer was a pitcher that the Tigers were looking at as well in the draft. I remember it. And we got one pack left. Uh, if you're with me, if you're staying with me, I really, really appreciate it, guys. Um, it means a bunch uh, for the channel. And um, we hope to bring you guys a lot more content where this came from. So last pack right here. CJ Crone, Pete Alonzo, Will Myers. New Age Performers, Fernando Tatis. I like that card. Um, 2020 NL Pitching Leaders, Zach Davies, Max Fried. Again, we got that card. And uh, Brandon Workman. So this card is pretty nice. I think this is just an insert. New Age Performers insert. That's pretty nice. Put that over here. But yeah, let me know down in the comments what you guys thought about the video. Um, really appreciate you guys watching, tuning in. And uh, we're going to be back with another video very, very shortly. Hopefully we can get some Don Russ basketball. Haven't gotten much of that on our hands. And uh, I'll, and we're going to be ripping a lot more baseball where this came from. So if you love baseball, uh, we really, really, truly appreciate the sport. But leave a comment down below, as I said. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace out, y'all.